Hello everyone. I'm going to give you a demo of the Weather Plasma for KDE4. So let's load that up now. As you can see, this is the very first time it's loaded. It asks you to configure a weather location. So let's do that. In the, in the configuration dialog, you'll notice that there are currently three different data sources you can choose from. The BBC plugin right now does not work. Uh, I'm working on that one. So let's choose a place in uh, Canada. Now, when you type uh, in, in the location field, you don't have to specify the full name of the place. The uh, engines are smart enough to return a matching keywords. So if I type in van and click search, I will get uh, three cho choices in this case. So let's choose uh, uh, Vanderhoof, BC. When I click the apply or OK buttons, the weather, current weather information will be displayed in the plasmoid. As you can see, there is the weather information. You can load multiple weather applets, as we do here, and you can choose different places from different sources. So let's choose, uh, as in Aaron's previous example of the weather plasmoid or data engine, Cake Airport. No, if you type a matching keyword and there's only one matching place, it will automatically populate it in the uh, tree list here. So I'll click Apply or OK, and you'll notice that I can now see the weather for Cake uh, Airport, Alaska. So this is currently what the weather plasma supports. Eventually I will be adding uh, some nice icons for the current conditions and uh, some other features in the future. So you can get the source for this in the KDE Playground. I hope to move the applet into KDE Base once uh, Aaron uh, has uh, given its blessing. So I'm uh, sorry there will be no uh, outro music or cheesy outro music at all. Bye now.